Oh, I'm sorry, but I just have to bring some bad news to a load of 360 fanboys that are constantly saying that the PlayStation does not have Mass Effect 2 yet, so therefore they can't class it as uh, multiplat. It's still a Microsoft exclusive. Not anymore. It's gone. Mass Effect 2 demo is now on PlayStation Network. And as far as I'm concerned, if you can play Mass Effect 2, even in a demo form, on the PlayStation, therefore it's no longer a 360 exclusive. And that's before 2011. So within the same year as it coming out on the 360, it came out on the PS3. That's, you know, I mean the release date of the title is, is next year, but the actual demo is this year. I just, you know, just thought I'd put this video on there just to help a lot of 360 fanboys realise that using Mass Effect 2 as a shield really isn't a good idea. Gears of War 3, you know, Forza Motorsports 4, they're good shields. Mass Effect 2, why use it? It's old. I'm going to try it out and see what it's like. I mean, I completed it on the uh, 360. I completed it twice on the 360. The chances are I probably won't get it for the PS3. Unless it like, comes down in price. Which it probably inevitably will. Hardly and all buy it and then suddenly it will just come down in price. And it will be like 30, maybe 25, 30 pound. Then I might actually consider it. But if it's 40, 45, forget it. It's not worth a purchase in my book. Oh well, anyway, you can see the size of the file, which is nearly two and a half, two and a half gig. And I've got 48 minutes left, which, to be honest with you, isn't bad at all. I know everyone says how slow PlayStation Network is, but recently things have got faster, so, you know, there it is. Don't need so any more. I'm just going to go out of this. Sort of it's on the uh, PlayStation Network. Uh, that's it then. Mass Effect 2 is now on PlayStation Network and um, PS3.